Oh my god, there's a wasp. Oh, please leave. Oh my Christ. Hey guys, um, welcome back to my channel. I've got a very orange and red theme today. So the reason you're seeing another background is actually because I'm well, in the UK we're in lockdown at the moment and I've actually gone to stay with my boyfriend. Uh, so this is his room. Um, <laughs> I feel like in the past few years I've given you so many different backgrounds. My uni background, my like home background, this background. But yeah, this will be it for a couple of weeks until the lockdown ends and then hopefully I should be back home again. So I've just come on today um, to show you a few of my birthday bits that I got. It was my birthday on Halloween, which I think was a week and a half ago. I'm losing track of time. Yeah, it was not last weekend, but the weekend before that. Um, an absolutely, absolutely lovely day. Um, of course, we didn't do much because we weren't in lockdown then, but there were still restrictions. Um, so I just had a pretty chill day, to be honest, and then got a takeaway in the evening. So it was really lovely. Um, and I thought you just might want to see some of the bits I got. So let's get started. So I only got one present from my parents, and when you see it, you'll know why. So. I got these Dr. Martins from my parents. Um, as you can see, they're kind of like Mary Jane style. Um, so a bit see through here, um, but they're absolutely gorgeous. Um, had my eye on them for a while, but they were, I think they were like 115 pounds or something. Um, my parents managed to get 10% off, <laughs> which you know obviously really helps when it's that price. Um, but yeah, so I completely didn't expect anything else from my parents because look how gorgeous these are. So I was really, really thrilled to get these. Um, but yeah. I haven't worn them yet because I'm currently wearing them in. I've got my socks that I use for skiing, <laughs> so I wear these when I'm when I'm wearing these, um, just so I don't break my feet. Basically, um, it's my first proper pair of um, Doc Martens. But yeah, I'm super excited to wear these and style these. So yeah, many thanks to my parents for these. So in the morning of my birthday, I actually spent it round my boyfriend's house, and then in the afternoon I went home and saw my parents. So from my boyfriend, I actually got gonna be really loud. I actually got these socks, I don't know if you can see them, I'll do a little close up for them. Um, but they're basically just pink sparkly socks and then I got some creamy sparkly ones as well. And this was because he knew that I was getting Doc Martens and um, I wanted some nice socks to go underneath them so I completely didn't expect to get this. Um, I actually thought on the day of my birthday, oh I should have asked for these and they, of course he knew. Um, so yeah, absolutely really happy with these. And then also for my boyfriend, he also got me this mug, um, which I've been drinking out of pretty much every morning since I've got it. Um, he knows that I just love mugs, and this one's from Anthropology, and I absolutely love their stuff. But obviously, it's some it's a bit pricey, so I don't often buy myself it. So yeah, was absolutely happy to get this as well, and it's gorgeous. Again, I'll do a little close up for you. And then the last thing I got for my boyfriend, honestly, I couldn't believe he'd got me this many presents. It was so nice of him. Um, I had this cardigan in mind for, for the longest time. Um, let me see if I can show it to you. So that's what the cardigan looks like. It's a little bit cropped. Um, it's in the lilac colour and oh my god, I love it so much. I've pretty much been dragging it out at any occasion. I was going to go for a dog walk the other day and I pulled it out to wear and I thought, no, it's, it's too nice for a dog walk. I could imagine some like big dog like jumping up on me with his mini muddy paws and yeah, so I did leave it out of that one, but I love it so, so much, and it's the warmest thing, the cosiest thing, so thank you very much, Jack, for all my presents. <laughs> and then I was actually really fortunate enough to get a present from Jack's parents, which, oh my god, I love it so, so much. So anybody that knows me well will know that I absolutely love candles, and especially this time of year, it's the best thing, is putting on your fairy lights and lighting your candles, so... The one that they bought me came in this cute little bag and then when you open it up, oh my god it smells delicious. I couldn't pin the scent of it and when I looked it's because it's got so many things in that I couldn't quite pinpoint what it was. But yeah it just comes like this and it's absolutely gorgeous. I don't know if you can see, I'll do a little like close up of the candle, but it's got little like gems like kind of stuck into the candle and they're meant to be kind of... Um, you know, like the the crystals that are supposed to be really like healing and make you feel calm and stuff like that. Um, so that's really cute because I've never had anything like this before. So this is like really unique. And I'm kind of on, I really, really want to burn it so I can smell it. But then I just don't want to ruin it because it looks so lovely. So um, 
God, I wish you could smell it. It just, oh, it smells so good. But yeah. Oh, such a gorgeous present. So thanks, Jack's parents, if you're watching for this. <laughs> Jack's sister, Georgia, again, if you're watching, thank you. Uh, she got me a present. Um, honestly, like I've been truly, truly spoiled. So thank you, everyone, for your presents. Um, but I, honestly, I absolutely love scarves and I left one of my favourite scarves in New York when I was travelling and I was absolutely gutted about it and then Jack bought me one last year that I love and then now I've got another new favourite scarf so this, yeah this one was from Georgia and it's lilac colour again I feel like there's a little theme because the candle was lilac as well but oh my god this is the fluffiest thing you've ever seen in your life and it's so soft and I just honestly I can't wait to just wear this with my winter coat. Oh, I'm gonna be the coziest person ever. Um, it's really cute, it's lilac, and then it kind of goes down to white here. But yeah, oh, I can't wait to wear this. I feel like recently it hasn't actually been cold enough in the UK to wear like scarves and that. As soon as it does, I'm gonna be whipping this one out. But yeah, thank you very much, Georgia. This is the coziest thing in the world. But keeping on the same kind of cozy theme, I also got a surprise present from um, my friends that I went travelling with. So I had an ASOS par parcel turn up at Jack's house um, and I thought it was the stuff I ordered and it came in like two hours and I was like, oh my god, that's the quickest ASOS I've ever done an order. <laughs> and um, Jack was like, at first he kind of was like, yeah, and then in the end he was like, no, <laughs> no it's not. Um, so it's going to be really hard to show. It's this kind of hoodie and it's got a little hood here it's got pockets so it's proper like a jumper but it's got stars and it's honestly the softest thing it's like pretty much like that scarf but in a jumper and then if that wasn't enough it comes in the joggers as well and oh my god I couldn't believe it when I opened this it's just it's you know one of those things you don't know you need it until you've got it and then you think how did I ever live without this I've been wearing this every single night pretty much <laughs> It's the coziest thing and there's been because it's not that cold there's been nights where I've actually just been too hot in them and I had to kind of change but they are oh I can't wait until it's actually like December and really cold and I'm just snuggled in these so thank you very much guys for that honestly like I love them so much <laughs> I feel like I'm kind of whipping through this video a little bit so the present I got for my granddad um wasn't strictly a surprise because I did say to my mum that I wanted it um, but I wasn't sure who I was getting it from. Um, so, yeah, this was from my granddad. Um, and I'm actually wearing one of them today. <laughs> but yeah, I got these scrunchies from Urban Outfitters. Jack's sister actually pointed them out to me and I love them. It's really hard to see, like, over camera, but they all have, like, different textures. This one's a cord one. And then they have ones that are, like, borg and kind of, like, knitted as well. And, oh, they are the softest things and they're so cute. I've been looking for scrunchies that are like a little bit different and these are definitely them. I think they were only about £10 which is an absolute bargain considering you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight scrunchies in there. So yeah, really really chuffed with these and I've been wearing a different scrunchie pretty much every day in my hair. <laughs> so yeah, thanks granddad. <laughs> he is almost definitely not watching. <laughs> and then from my auntie and uncle, I actually got this, this was another thing that I asked for but again I didn't know who I was getting it from so it was really really nice to receive. Um, I got this Real Techniques uh, brush cleaner thing, let me get it out and I can show you what it's like. So it's, it looks like this, looks pretty funny um, but yeah it's got one of these on the back, it's like kind of like a pop socket. I've never had one before but it's yeah, it's, so you can kind of hold it like that with your hands which is really useful. Um, and then inside it's got, I don't know if you can see, but it's got all these little crosses. So when you clean your brushes, it actually gets like everything out of it. Um, and I saw it and I thought this was absolutely genius and will definitely make me want to wash my brushes more because it will actually make it easier for me. So yeah, this is amazing and I'm so excited. I'm actually really excited to wash my brushes just so I can kind of use it. <laughs> but yeah, so thank you very much for that. I'm honestly, I'm really happy with it. <laughs> I feel like as you get older it's just the little things in life that really really make you happy. So I haven't received my presents from my other siblings yet, um, but I did get a present from my brother who's also living at home with me, um, and it's this beautiful ring, I'm going to do another clip for it, um, and it's actually a thumb ring that I um, found on Etsy. Um, I'd wanted a thumb ring for ages, but um, I've got my, my fingers are quite 
quite podgy. So I wasn't sure what size ring to get and I didn't want it to be tight. So I actually got one of those ones that's um, kind of like open and you can kind of extend it yourself. Um, you'll see when I put the clip in. Um, but yeah, I actually I love it so much. Um, it looks really cute. I don't know if you can see a cute addition to my rings. I've got two on there and then now I've got my thumb ring. Um, so yeah, thank you very much Michael for that. So I think this is the last present. Don't hold me to it. I think it is. I'm really sorry if I've forgotten anyone's presents. I'm literally the most forgetful person ever. The last present's actually from my nan and it's this little body shop bag of goodies basically. Um, I'm wearing the nail varnish today. It's kind of like an orangey red kind of colour. Um, and this is the cutest thing ever. So let me show you what's inside. So yeah, you get their little nail, nail polish. Um, I've actually never used any body shop nail varnishes before, I actually didn't know they did them but oh my god, I only had to do one coat and that was enough for this and it dried so quickly so if they have more, I'll be buying them again for sure so I got a shower gel, don't try and ask me what it's called Polynesian Island Tiare, something like that I don't, I'm really bad at pronouncing stuff but I'll do a close up for you um, so yeah, always love a bit of shower gel um, Christmas and my birthday is the best because I feel like I always get a top up. I also got this little cream, um, the Body Shop Oils of Life Intensely Revitalising Sleeping Cream. Um, so I think it just just goes on your face. I'm not sure if this is like a full version, maybe it's a mini version actually because it's pretty mini. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'll have to look that up. Got a little pencil sharpener which is the best. Um, so yeah, we'll be using that. <laughs> Again, it wouldn't be a body shop gift set if you didn't have the, some kind of lotion in there. So this is a whipped lotion and it's just the mango kind of flavour. I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna have a whiff. Oh, that smells delightful. And then I think there was an eyelash curler in there as well which I've taken that out and put that somewhere. So I'm sorry that's not in the video. I got this little brush. Um, I think, yeah, this is an eyeshadow brush. So that's really cute. I actually have another body shop Oh my god, there's a wasp. Oh, please leave. Oh my Christ. Okay, I'm going to get a bit of paper. Oh, right. God, that was eventful. I completely forgot where I was. Yeah, I do have another Body Shop um, makeup brush. I have a highlighter one, which I really love as well, so I'm excited to try this out as well. And the last thing that was in the Body Shop bag was um, this lip crayon, it's like a lip definer um, in the colour Pink Clover, um, which is kind of like a nude, which is actually really, really helpful because I bought a red lip liner for my red lipstick, but I didn't actually buy a nude one, so I'm really happy that I have this, because um, now I have one. So yeah, I'm pretty sure that's everything. I Honestly, I forget everything, but I just wanted to use this opportunity to thank everybody for their presents, for their cards. Um, if you sent me a message, or if you sent me a message on Instagram, thank you everybody for your birthday wishes. I had a really lovely day, um, I got some really lovely presents, I've been truly, truly spoiled, so thank you everybody for that. And I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did like it, feel free to subscribe and give it a little, little thumbs up. Um, and even comment if you like to, what's your favourite present? Mine, I don't know, they're all my favourites, I love them so much, I don't think I could even pick. But yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.